Osmotic power is based on the natural phenomenon osmosis, where water moves through a semi-permeable membrane from water with a low concentration of salts to one with a high concentration. When fresh water and salt water collide, for example at the mouth of a river, an enormous amount of energy is unleashed as the waters of different salinity combine into a state of less ordered, uniform salinity. The mixing generates a significant 2.2 kilojoules of energy per litre of fresh water. Osmotic power stations recreate and harness this process by separating a tank of fresh water and a tank of salt water with a semi-permeable membrane. This membrane allows fresh water to pass while remaining impermeable to salts, so the fresh water is drawn through the membrane into the salt water side, equalising the difference in salinity and raising the pressure in the salt water tank. That huge pressure, the equivalent of a 120 metre water column, drives a conventional power turbine. It's estimated that a large osmotic power station could produce enough clean energy to run 30,000 European homes. Small osmotic power stations could be integrated into the basements of buildings, generating power for the surrounding district. A small experimental osmotic power station has already been built at Tofte in Norway, successfully creating 10 kilowatts of electricity. A full commercial osmotic power station will be online in 2015.